Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. The purpose of today's video is to give you guys um, some things that I ran out of. So basically an empties video and I'm going to do some things ranging from hair products to household products to things for your body. So if you guys are interested in seeing what I got, definitely stay tuned. Okay, so the first thing that I got is just this um, BB... Um, moisturizing wrapping lotion foam and it just looks like this um, it's nothing too fancy I picked this up I want to say from my local beauty supply store um, no more than five dollars this cost oh there's still a little bit in here so maybe I still consider it an empty because there's basically nothing left in here but I use this when I um, put like flexi rods in my mom's hair or if I just want to put some wrapping lotion on my hair when I have my um, natural hair out, I would use this just to give me that extra oomph. Um, overall, I feel like it worked pretty good. Um, will I repurchase it? Yes, because this wasn't my first time purchasing this. Um, I feel like it works really good. It doesn't make your hair hard or anything. It leaves your hair soft and it has an amazing smell to it. Like... I can't even describe the smell. So this would definitely be a repurchase. I love this product, so yes. The next product is just this beautiful Textures Curl Definer Mousse um, for mixed textures, curly, wavy, kinky, coily, frizzy, and it just looks like this. There's like a little left in here too, but like these little pumps don't do anything because I put like so much on my hair just to give it like that wet, curly look. This one, it really didn't have like much of a significant smell like the other one i i don't think i would repurchase this one it works pretty good but i just didn't like the texture that it gave my hair versus the other wrapping lotion so this one it's okay it might work for different people different strokes for different folks but i'd rather purchase the other wrapping lotion so this will not be a repurchase the next two items that i got are just these olive oil um edge control things and this was the main um Carded and it just looks like this well container and then it just gave you like a free little sample so i always just threw this like in my purse this i will not repurchase this like i don't know about you guys but when i put this on my edges like not too long after it like flakes up it makes my hair look white my hair doesn't stay down around my edges for a long time so i will not repurchase this um unfortunately this wasn't a hit it was a miss um as far as price, I don't believe it cost more than $5 either. I got it from my local beauty supply store. And the last mousse that I showed you guys actually came from um, my local Dollar General. Um, and that was about 2 to $3 or something like that. So this, I wanted it to work so bad. I just kept using it because I spent my money on it. But I need to find like another edge control because this, this is not it. The next thing that I have is just this Miss Jessie Super Sweet Back Treatment. Um, the best darn tr deep treatments period and it just looks like this and this I would definitely repurchase repurchase this like this smells like bubblegum like oh my god it smells so good I always applied this to my hair before I washed it it just left my hair feeling oh so good and I don't know I like things that go in my hair with a, a nice smell especially something that smells like bubblegum and it was pink and I feel like it definitely did what it said it was going to do give myself with my hair a nice treatment and I had natural hair so this Miss Jessie's is a little on the expensive side this was hmm I don't know maybe it was over 20 or something like that but this can get pretty pricey but it's well worth it it lasted me for a long time so this is definitely a repurchase the next item that I got is this Miss Jessie's curly pudding um this is the best darn curl creams period so it just looks like this I love the packaging of Miss Jessie's um this one was purple like it had like a nice smell to it this one i always use this when i put um bantu knots in my hair and my bantu knots like when i took them down my curls were always on fleek like this it was because of this like i used this along with the next product that i'm going to show you guys with miss jesse's and like it left my hair soft like my hair lasted for days so i love this stuff and the next item that i was telling you about was this miss jesse's pillow soft curls and this is the best darn super soft styling lotion. So it just looks like this. 
And like, I just love this. I would wet my hair, like dry it a little bit, put a little, the, little bit of this on and then put the um, curling pudding on and then just, you know, twist my hair, wrap it around, let it set overnight. And when I get up in the morning, I just combed them out, separated the Bantu knots and I was good to go. It gave me a quick, easy style. I did not put like 50 million small Bantu knots around my hair. Like I just did like a nice amount and the curls still look good. So this was a great product as well. And I love like the squeezing thing versus the other ones where you have to stick your hand in it. This you use less product, but I mean, they both work. The next item that I got is just this Eco Styler Professional Styling Gel in Olive Oil. And it just looks like this. And so many people have raved about this on YouTube. This costs $2.99. Um, this isn't the biggest... Um, container next time i purchase this which this will be a repurchase um i will get the big one because it's definitely worth it it made my hair feel so good um i feel like the more you use it it better tames your hair and get that particular curl pattern that you want but when i first used it i really didn't know what i was doing so it just did what it wanted to do but after you constantly using it you know how to work the product it definitely works very well for your hair so repurchase the next item is just this um, olive oil nourishing sheen spray and it just looks like this and you know I went to work on this because the <laughs> applicator came off but this works so good it gives my hair that natural shine well as they say sheen um, I just sorry I just didn't want to get anything on this jacket like it's just so cute right I actually showed you guys this and Mm, I believe my last um, or my first clothing haul. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, just check it out if you guys haven't. Um, but yeah, back to this. Um, this was not too expensive. I feel like every product that I'm going to show you guys is under $10. No more than 5 or $6. So I picked this up from my local beauty supply store. And it definitely works well for my Senegalese twist. When I just feel like my hair is a little dry, which is kind of dry right now, but I have to go get another um, oil sheen. It just gives me that natural shine and just kind of brings my hair back to life. Now that I'm done with the hair products, I'm going to use, I mean, show you guys different things for like health and body. Um, the first thing that I'm going to show you guys is this Tree Hut Shea Sugar Scrub and Island Kiwi. And it just looks like this. And this like, oh my God, I got this from Walmart for like six or seven dollars and like when i take a shower and after i do everything else in my shower routine i just like put this on let it sit on my body and rinse it off like your body is just like so smooth like the exfoliation is like on fleek with this stuff like i love this so much i would definitely repurchase this i feel like they have like three or four different other um different kinds but i feel like this one smells the best and so I'm just going to keep repurchasing this one. It was definitely worth your money. The next item that I got is just this Moonlight Path um, Shea and Vitamin E Shower Gel by Bath and Body Works. And this was originally $12.50. But you know how you go when I think they have like buy three, get three, some stuff like that. I got it during that time. And it just looks like this. And this, this like, oh my God. The smell on this is like freaking amazing. Like it's loud and I love that during like the winter time. This, is, this isn't something that I would use for like spring or summertime. I normally like fresh and sweet type of scents. That's more like it's colder outside, something sexy, put on your skin type of smell. So I got that. The next empty um, is just this Pond's Dry Skin Cream. And the lettering is kind of peeling. But you guys already know I love my Pond's. When I wake up in the morning, like, put it on my face. My face feels so rejuvenated. So this is definitely going to re be a repurchase. I got this from Walmart as well. No more than 5 or $6. So pick this up. The next two items are actually um, my one-a-day vitamin pills and my iron medicine i told you guys i picked up from walmart um i believe this is in my what's in my bag um video and these have been so good to me i've been less tired i've been having more energy you guys know that i'm anemic so i definitely well you guys don't know but i'm telling you now so i definitely need iron and i don't know it just became a habit a part of my ritual to make sure that i take my vitamins every morning after i eat breakfast so if you guys 
you know, I kind of tell you, go to your doctor and see, like, if you guys need, like, any vitamins or something like that or iron medicine because you might have a low iron count. And it's very important to at least make sure your levels are where they should be. So check that out. And they, they didn't cost that much either. So <laughs> the next item is um, actually a body lotion. Um, called Beautiful Day from Bath and Body Works and it looks like this and I actually have the perfume with this as well And I believe the shower gel. I didn't get the candle. I got it and then I returned it because I'm like oh, I don't really know like I just I ended up getting another candle, but this one it smells good This is like a spring fragrance like I love this. This was originally 1250 but like I told you guys the three for three or whatever sales they have and also um, the retail me not coupon they always have like coupons for like ten dollars off 30 so you know I'm, I'm always using coupons y'all know like i don't like spending that much money at all if i can get at a cheaper price that's all me the next item that i have is this maximum strength mutinex fast max um little cough and chest congestion little thing and it just looks like this. And like when I was feeling so under the weather, I had to use this. This works very well. I feel like with the cap sizes, like if you use it constantly every day for like a week, it'll be gone. But it's well worth it. I'm not sure how much this one was. But again, I don't believe all of my items go over $10. So I got this. This is definitely a repurchase if I feel sick again. Because I was feeling terrible, guys. Like I hate when I'm sick because... Like, it just takes a toll on my body. Like, my throat starts hurting. Like, mucus. Everything. It was terrible. The next empty that I got is just this Pure Silk um, Shave Cream. And it just looks like this. And I got this from Walmart. Again, no more than 5 or $6. It probably was actually like 2 or $3. And what I love about this is that it's a rust-proof um, can. So, in the shower, it's not like it rusts no matter how much water gets on it. Um, I really like this. It leaves your skin smooth, so I definitely re will repurchase this. I might get it, like, in a different um, fragrance or whatever, but overall, I like Pure Silk. The next thing that's an empty is this Forever Red little um, sample size thing, um, perfume that I got from Bath & Body Works. It came in, like, a little kit that I got, and, like, this, oh, my God, I forgot how good it smells like I think that they have this like in the regular size I'm gonna have to go back and get this because this fragrance let me see if I can squeeze a little bit out oh it's a little came out like oh my god it's just it makes you feel like grown and sexy that's basically what I can say like I love this stuff so much <laughs> this is kind of nasty but the last one I have is just this EOS and like this little mint color and I don't even want to show it it got like so much makeup um, eyeliner marks on it but it just looks like this and it smells good I actually like EOS I know there was a thing going around like that it was doing stuff to people's lips it haven't did anything to mine which that that doesn't mean like you should keep trying stuff you should definitely investigate to see you know if those claims are true but I was already using it so I just finished my stuff up so I got that one from Nordstrom for about two or three dollars so got that and the last thing pertaining to like health, well, hygiene wise, is this um, Equate Antiseptic Mouth Rinse and Spring Mint. And I got this from Walmart. It was a two pack. And this is amazing. Like, it smells, it smells good. Like, it, it just leaves your mouth feeling fresh. And nothing's more, well, not nothing's more important, but dental hygiene is very important. So I picked that up again, no more than $10, which I don't even think it was that since it's a um, store brand. You guys know like Equate is like cheaper. So I got that. Now the last thing that I, last um, three, four, six things that I got are just air fresheners for the house. And the first three that are empty are just these Hawaii um, air wick fragrance and they just look like this and these smell freaking amazing and obviously they do because we went through three of them like it just makes you feel like you're just somewhere tropical and you just want to dance and like got your feet in the water I love these so much the only thing that I don't like is that they can get kind of like too strong I like fresh scents that aren't like overbearing but it clears up smells basically so this Although I love it, I, I won't repurchase this because the scent just gets too strong when you just keep spraying it and different things like that. And ain't nobody got time for that. 
the next Airwick um, air freshener I got is this 4-in-1 Magnolia and Cherry Blossom. This one, I hate this one, actually. It, like, it gives you, like, a powder, pink powder smell, but I don't like it for, like, spraying it in the house. So, I don't know. This, this will not be a repurchase. I really didn't like this one at all. And I believe air fresheners are like a dollar, two dollars or something like that from like Walmart. You can get them from the dollar stores like Dollar General. And yeah. And then the last two items that I got are just these for Breeze Air Effects. Um, I have one in Hawaiian Aloha and one in Spring and Renewal. And they just look like this. And both of these I would definitely repurchase. These are like bomb.com. Like they're just so bomb. Like the Hawaiian um, Aloha, it smells good. It doesn't have that same effect like the Airwick one. And this spring and renewal, like, this is like heaven on earth. Like, I think I might buy this one more so than this one, but I can definitely repurchase both of these. Basically, all that I had to show you guys, let me know if you like this video by giving it a thumbs up. That's like my little indicator to know, like, girl, we like these kind of videos. Keep doing it. Subscribe if you guys haven't. Share, comment. Um, and until next time, guys, stay blessed, stay beautiful, and I love you.